hello guys uh, welcome to aspiring architect so today we are going to see how to push and pull images um, from local or to local from and to the docker hub so docker hub is an online uh, repository service where you can store the docker images which you built or uh, the images which are already available for public usage so docker hub can have a uh, your images hosted for both public and the private access depending upon your requirement and depending upon the type of account you have so this is the simple workflow architecture of how the docker hub works so first you build a docker image from a docker file so to build a docker uh, image from a docker file there are a set of standards which you need to follow um, so we will cover that in maybe in the upcoming videos that is if you are interested so once you have a docker image ready from the docker file you can use the docker image to deploy a docker container so this is a part of the cacd pipeline so or you can if you have a cacd um, you know tool or something like that you can create a make file to continuously integrate and continuously deploy to uh, and the important part is once you build an image uh, you might want to push it to a repository which in our case is the docker hub you could also set up your own private repositories too so once it's on the docker hub you you can pull this particular image anywhere everywhere so uh, as long as you have docker installed so you can either deploy it to the staging servers or the production servers depending upon your requirement so let's get started um, the basic requirement or the prerequisites is to have your uh, docker installed on the machine and then you would want to have a uh, docker hub account so you just go to hub.docker.com and you sign up an account for yourself so as you can see uh, this is my account aspiring architect and i don't have any particular repositories in this so uh, this is where you want to come in once you log in so the next step you would want to do is uh, um, you want to open up the powershell so as you can see i have uh, nothing over here locally so there, there are no images so first let me try to pull the nginx image for this particular demonstration So when I'm saying uh, docker pull nginx that means that it is automatically going to pick up the latest tag unless and until you specify a particular tag it is always going to assume that you want to download the latest uh, version of the nginx image. So once I pulled in I can verify it uh, you can issue the command docker images and you can see that now I have the uh, nginx image. So the size is 142 MB. So our goal here is to uh, push this particular image into your repository which is in docker hub so first to do this you want to log in so you can issue the command docker login so uh, this is the username and the password you which you use to sign up and login into the web account of the docker hub So my login has succeeded. The next thing I would want to do is I want to tag the particular nginx image which is now available. So I would do a docker tag. The first one is which is already available which is the nginx latest. So I want to uh, tag this so that I can upload uh, I can push it to the docker hub to my particular repository. So I'd say aspiring architect nginx and latest. So I, I hope this is uh, understood. So this is my account. So uh, depending upon your account, you would want to give it first and then you want to give the slash, then the image name and the tag name. So once this is done, you want to push this image into the Docker repository. you would say just docker push uh, 
so you have different layers so each layer has to be you know prepared and then you know uploaded or mounted from the nginx uh, library so you can see the status and it should be pretty quick because the size of the uh, image over here is 142 mb when you do a docker images now at the local machine you must see this particular um, aspiring architect nginx because it is tagged it is the same size so let's go to the docker hub and do a refresh as you can see this is now available uh, so you can download the same thing you can uh, you know uh, push pull or you can do anything over here it, this is for you know if you want to do a uh, another push with a different tag name so currently we have the latest tag over here you can see the different image layers over here which uh, how it is actually built so let's first uh, try to remove the existing image i'll do a docker rmi and i'll do a aspiring architect nginx latest so this is this is gone so let's try to uh, pull this particular image from the web from your repository so here i have the image so if i do a docker images i'll see that you know the new image has been downloaded so what we can do over here is we can just try to run this particular image just to see how it works so let's run a container i'll do a docker run um, so let's say i want to do a port of 80 to 80 so the first 80 is of the container port which is of nginx and the next 80 is the host port so how do i want to map it from container to the host and then i want to give the image name and i want to run in a detached mode so this is currently running so let's just verify it So you can see that you know my nginx server is running and is being listened on the port 80 which is the one which we actually uh, used to map you can also run it in the detached mode by using the command hyphen itd so this is all uh, i hope you really like the content let me know what other content you would want to uh, see in the future again uh, please like subscribe and share this video if you think this is helpful thank you uh, see you again